What's up, Libra, kings, queens, and everything in between? I'm Austria of Unbothered Queen. And today I will be channeling the collective of Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Mercury in regards to love for a general versus message for the 2nd through the 8th. Please keep in mind that this time frame is only for me, so whenever you see this message, that's when you are meant to see it. These messages are timeless. Okay, also I'm getting mutual energy for you and your person right now. Also, if it doesn't resonate, check out your other placements. Thank you. Two more, Spirit. Two more. Thank you. A little bit more than two, but okay. All right, so we got forgiving and apology in the reverse, epiphany and breakthrough in the reverse, assistance and spirit guides, and um, gratitude and present abundance in the reverse. Somebody is resisting, resistant help or assistance from their spirit guides during this time. This could be you or your person's energy. I'm also getting that some of you guys are in separation from your person and you're wanting to get back together. But someone here is is kind of um, stuck in the past, thinking about things that have already happened, not really wanting to offer forgiveness here. I'm also getting that somebody is not seeing the error in their ways. They're only seeing the error in your ways, or this could be vice versa. Please take it as it resonates. <coughs> All right, I'm also, I also have Autumn and Harvest. So some of you can be... Um, harvesting the fruits of your labor like all the time and effort that you put into this relationship you be, could be getting this um back here during this time and that means like i feel like this person could be coming towards you some of you are using um alchemy for uh to, to make a foundation solid here um that doesn't that never works so if you're trying to use like somebody's i feel like someone's trying to use like magic or something to um solidify like a union or some shit like that that shit never works okay y'all so just be keep that in mind here you gotta you gotta do it the old-fashioned way and if it's meant to be it's gonna happen but i'm also getting you're getting downloads from your ancestors and guys about that too like of not you know taking those steps moving forward i'm also getting that um like, it's almost like you're tapping into, like, ancestral magic here. All right, we got distance here. Yeah, some of you guys are definitely in separation from this person, but you guys do not want to be. You know, you do not want to be in distance from this person. Yeah, integration and union in the reverse, too. Yeah, it's definitely, you guys aren't seeing eye to eye. You guys aren't on the same page during this time. And I just saw love-hate here. So you and this person could have some sort of love-hate relationship here. I just saw also tough beginnings. So you could be dealing with mother sucker. You could be dealing with your twin flame here, you guys. All right. Some of you could be having to travel to this person. This person could possibly not live close to you here. Thank you. All right. So we have change, miracles and compromise and this is my third party card so whoever was in put you in some sort of third party they want forgiveness for this and again this is mutual energy but i'm saying you because it's your message if somebody put you in a third party energy this is the person that is not finished they're not over this yet this person is saying that they know that you've lost hope in them but they're going to surprise you here this person is wanting to come in and change energy you could be dealing with a scorpio oh shoot similar friendship romantic partner chaser hot pursuit so yeah you're just on a break from this person during this time here 
you know somebody is always the chaser and runner in this situation so this is why y'all can't get on the same page All right, Spirit, thank you for clear concise messages here. Somebody dreams about having sex with you. All right, we got kicked out, wrong way, insecure cash flow. All right, so somebody can be insecure here. They could be feeling like they don't have enough money to sustain a relationship with you. Or um, they could be using money to kind of make them feel less insecure. So more money that they have, the more they feel better about themselves. I'm also getting uh, wrong way. It says the direction that you were moving was the wrong way. So somebody was doing something that wasn't right and they could have got kicked out here. Somebody could have been in a situation where the third party situation that you were in in, they were in another stable union and that's why you guys were, weren't able to like really make this shit work all right y'all let's go ahead and get your person's intention here all right we got cleanse your space love affair what did i say what we've been saying this whole time love affair dirty little secret down low mm -hmm. Some of y'all people could be on the down low. Look, you ain't heard that from me though. Regrets. I regret the things I should have done but never did here. So yeah, this person is wanting to come towards you and um, kind of clear the energy and the space here from this putting you in some sort of third party situation. Um, this person is definitely in the energy of possibly regretting the things that they did to you here. All right. Give me more on intent spirit. Give me more on intent, please. Thank you. Thank you. All right, yep. Ace of Cups here. You could be dealing with the Scorpio, Pisces, or Cancer. This person has a lot of love for you here. They want to offer you new love. They want to come towards you here. This person, yep. Title card, baby. Yeah, Page of Pentacles, though, it may seem like they're not offering that much to you here or they're only offering you a little bit. You could also be dealing with the Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. But this person wants to have a high-level commitment with you with the title card showing up. Come the fuck through. I'm getting it. They regret putting somebody else before you. Yeah, you can definitely be dealing with the Capricorn, Queen of Pentacles here. Capricorn energy as well as Sagittarius, King of Wands, Sagittarius, Scorpio energy with the Nine of Pentacles. This person could have felt like they sabotaged this relationship here with you. They could have felt like um, they could have possibly chose their child's parent over you here. This person could have also been in their player ways during this time. I'm also getting that this person is very charismatic. They really drew you in here, but this person is definitely feeling like they missed out on the opportunity here with you. All right, let's get your intent here, Libra. We got Halloween, something significant about this holiday. So, um, I don't know. For some of y'all, I'm getting that y'all like to be in costume or like you're hiding something about how you feel or some shit with this card. Um, we also have Drama Queen, Thirsty, and Cause of Chaos. So, you could possibly be Cause of Chaos in this bitch which is um kind of not it's kind of out of your character y'all kind of unbothered by shit but it happens um rushing in i can't wait to any longer i'm making a move so y'all could have been the people that was popping up on this person y'all could have been popping up on this person and maybe that's how you found out they was living with somebody maybe you got their ass kicked out <laughs> That's not funny, but y'all gotta admit it's got a it's, it's a little chuckle chuckle. Okay. Alright, Spirit. Give me more about the intent for Libra here. Give me more about the intent for Libra. Thank you for clearing precise messages here. Thank you. Alright. Nine of Wands here. So you're a bit guarded against this person here. It's like you see this person for who they truly are now, and you're no longer um it's like you're no longer really um, waiting for this person to change I'm getting here. It's like you're seeing this person's true nature here. Some of you feel like this person owes you an apology. Capricorn and Aquarius energy with the Knight of um, Swords here. Yeah, you think about this person a lot. This person be running around your mind rent free, Libra. This has to be running around in your mind a lot. Like, it's something about this situation that you can't leave alone. But you're, it's like, 
you're putting up the front though that you don't want this person or you're guarded against this person but you still want them you just want them to act right and you want them to come towards you it's like the things that you feel for this person you're keeping it inside here you guys had a lot of amazing sex here yes capricorn energy here with the um with the devil card in the reverse this is definitely like some sort of sexual addiction here so either you or this person could have experienced that um and i'm also getting that this passionate relationship it kind of made you confused about um about how things were moving forward it made you feel like so it was something that it wasn't like you guys could have been in some sort of fr friends with benefit situation but the sex kind of like made it uh it, it like jaded you to feel like maybe this can go somewhere maybe we can be something more without really having that conversation um for some of you this person could have been literally in that energy and telling you shit like uh yeah i do love you i do want to be with you but you didn't know all of this other shit that they had going on and they could have been telling the truth but it's just like baby you gotta choose we, you just can't have me and other people let's get their challenge all right so we got lying someone is lying so yep to grip anchor chains weighed down tough beginning it's not going to be easy but i'm waiting i'm willing to fight for our love so this is the card that i saw when we were when we were shuffling and this is definitely that energy like this person they know that it's going to be hard to kind of get you back in a place where you're wanting to be with them especially after all the lies that they they've um told um they could have possibly had you in a third party situation here I'm also getting, um, some of them could have recently had a child, and that could have been who they were dealing with, their child's parent. Okay. They also feel stuck in a situation for a lot of you, is the energy I'm getting. Go ahead and give me the challenge here, Spirit. Thank you. Yeah, they're finding it very hard to heal this you and to be able to move forward with you here. They don't really know which steps to take here with the temperance card, Sagittarius' energy. Yeah, six of swords here. And yeah, they want to make this shit work and they don't but they don't know how. They don't know how to make it work. They don't know how to heal this connection. A lot of you aren't really talking to this person at this time, so they don't know how to move forward here. But this person definitely refuses to let go of this like it's like they're gonna do whatever they need to to make this shit work like it says i'm willing to fight for our love yep seven of wands here in the reverse seven of cups and the lover's card gemini energy you could have been dealing with somebody that legit chose somebody else over you you know and now they're trying to back backtrack because that relationship didn't work out so now that's why they're they don't know how to fix it because how you come back from some shit like that like you should have chose me the first time mm. and they're afraid that you're gonna meet if they don't get their shit together somebody else is gonna snatch you up is the energy i'm getting we got new views, seeing things from a higher perspective, ascension, spiritual path, awakening, twin flame. I remember who you are. I've loved you before. So, yeah, I already said that shit, though. Like, you could definitely be dealing with your twin flame during this time, and that's why you're feeling this magnetic pull to this person. And that's why you're seeing things differently in regards to this relationship versus other relationships. Like, I feel like you were able to get over other people way quicker than you're able to get over this person and it's because you're in a space where you're trying to it's like you're trying to understand why you still are thinking about them first of all you guys are energetically connected so the, when they think about you you're gonna think about them as well also this is your person you know, it, it doesn't, you don't just stop thinking about them because you don't want to. But I would say, especially you guys that are on your spiritual um, awakening, go ahead and ask spirit to take thoughts away because I've done that. I've asked spirit to, you know, remove thoughts of this person away from me so I can just live my better life because ain't nobody got time for that. Control here with um, 
I feel like this person feels like they have lack of control of the situation. I'm getting that you could feel like this person was very controlling, very domineering. You could have been dealing with the Aries here. Um, you're definitely dealing with someone, like you could be dealing with their child's father here. A lot of you could possibly get over mommy or daddy issues. And this is why you are like gravitating towards this person or this is why this person triggered you so yeah two of cups here you could feel reject yeah you could feel rejected like i said it's like this person chose somebody else over you and you felt rejected by this two of cups in the reverse ace of cups in the reverse you felt like the love was unrequited you felt like this person didn't care about the connection you just felt it's like you felt some sort of weakness that you never felt before, you know, and, and you you do not never want to feel that. That's why some of you could have really acted immaturely, could have been popping up at this person's house, could have been fighting the other person, all type of shit you could have been doing because you felt like, how dare you disrespect me like this, especially because a lot of you told this person about the things that had happened to you and this person like, bitch, you going to just do it again? Yeah. A lot of you just want to be happy, want to be loved here. I'm also getting a lot of you guys are needing to focus on yourself here. And you're needing to move forward, you know, focus on your self-care here. You know, start working out, starting eat, eating better, eating clean. You could be dealing with the, um, another Libra or a Taurus here. All right, let's go ahead and get the actions here for your person. We got a new job. You're hired. You got the job. Drastic, extreme, harsh cutoff. Liberation. I'm setting myself free and embracing new experiences. So some of them, I feel like they're going to try to come towards you with the relationship offer here. They're going to try to come towards you with the relationship offer after they leave this person in the past. And it's kind of going to be up to you whether or not you want to accept it. Thank you, Spirit. For clear and concise messages. Thank you. Glad to give me the actions for leave this person. This person really loves you. But they're fucked up. And they're kind of manipulative. Yeah, the seven of wands in the reverse here. This person is definitely dealing with shit. They feel defeated in this time. They're very much so struggling to try to figure out how to get you back together, get back together with you. This person may express that um, with anger. King of Wands here. They're definitely a person that tries to, um, how can I say this? They try to take control of the situation, but they also try to act like they, they have so much confidence when they really don't. They're very much insecure about a lot of things. This person also has try to act very charismatic too. They're very charismatic and try to like get you to choose things. This person just really want to talk to you. Yeah, three of wands in the reverse because they realize that you're not coming towards them here. They're also, um, they're tired of this separation. So man, they just want you to know that they care about you. They want to talk to you, baby. Mm. Libra um, energy hit the justice card in the reverse nine of cups ace of pentacles yeah it's like you now they're feeling in a place where you've let them go like you're no longer interested in them or all of their dishonesty is kind of catching up to them and this is why they can't have this opportunity with their wish fulfillment which is you because they're wanting to have a stable, um, offer you a stable offer to be able to move forward. I feel like you are what this person considers, um, um, how can I say? Like, them being with you would be a selfish move, right? That's what they feel like you are their, in their best interest. And they feel like them letting you go was crazy as hell. They said, they're like, if you, if all you got to do is call and they're on the way. All right, we got astral travel. You may be having out-of-body experiences. 
hamster wheel surviving daily hustle so foolish i lack the maturity to handle a person like you so some of you could have been foolish in the past here or even feeling like you were very immature you dealt with the situation immaturely i'm also getting that you guys are having um dreams about this person a lot of you could be focusing on your monetary goals at this time because of this situation with this person it's like this situation with this person made you focus a lot more on your money this person wants you to give them a chance though Give me more about the actions here for Libra. Thank you. Yeah, Knight of uh, Cups in the reverse. You could be dealing with a Scorpio here with the Knight of Cups. Or you could be dealing um, with another Libra. Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands on both sides now. And the Ten of Cups. You doing whatever it is to make yourself fucking happy. You're not taking no more L's for no fucking body. Period. Okay? A lot of you could be in a place where you could have felt mentally um, depleted. You could have even been feeling a bit depressed given this situation with this person. But moving forward, you're like, no, I'm good. I'm speaking up for myself. Nobody's getting over on me. Whatever it takes for me to get to this Ten of Cups, that's what the fuck I'm doing. Yep. Yep. A lot of you are letting this person go. Even yep. A lot of you are letting this person go, even though it hurts. It hurts so bad for you to let this person go and release this person. But you're done being somebody's secret. You're done being somebody's third party situation. And you're like, no, I'm not dealing with that shit no more, right? You guys could have even felt for a while like you were a bit obsessed with this person or vice versa. You could have also but like right now you're just focusing on healing yourself. And moving away from this connection. All right, let's see here. What messages you have from your person? At least one more spirit. Okay, then. All right, we got Ace of Pentacles here, which is, um, you know, a stable offer here. This could also mean that you guys are connecting with a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. Um, we got You Matter, and this is from your spirit guides and your ancestors here. We got Yeah, Nah, like, yeah, I'm not dealing with this bullshit with you and this person. It says, I need more balance. And that's who you are. You're all about balance, Libra. And that's what you're needing. You're needing more balance in this situation. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe, you guys. It really helps me out. Let's get the um, signs that you guys are dealing with during this time here. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. All right, we got fire. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have Gemini here. We have Earth, um, Virgo, Capricorn, um, Taurus. A lot of you guys definitely dealing with the Earth sign here. And then we got Scorpio at the bottom. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. Thank you so much for all of your love and support. And I send it back to you guys tenfold. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.